Tongan residents have been urged to stay inside after a massive eruption at a nearby volcanic island today. Hunga Tonga lies around 60 kilometres from the mainland and while it's been erupting for up to a month, today's activity was the biggest so far, spewing ash, steam and gas 20 kilometres into the air. Jordan Rudd reports. An eruption of thick black ash spoiling the picture-perfect sea of blue. This just one in a series of explosions over the past three weeks on Hunga Tonga, the latest this morning. We discovered this morning that the, the, the eruption is a huge, it's seven times bigger than the eruption earlier, late last year and earlier this, this month. It's a particularly active area of volcanism in Tonga right now. So the ash that's generated along with that explosion usually rises to a few hundreds of metres to a few kilometres above surface, but not nearly as high as the steam that's ejected up to maybe 20 kilometres high. 60 kilometres away, residents in Tonga's capital could smell it. And we advise them, yeah, that's the south one. That's a start of eruption and that's normal. Swirling tides were seen at the Nuku Alofa waterfront today, prompting a warning for residents to stay away. We would not expect a tsunami to get any further than the very local regions around the islands. Air New Zealand says it's continuing cargo and repatriation flights in and out of Tonga as normal, but will amend the flight schedule if it becomes unsafe to fly. The advice now to Tongan residents... Protect their rainwater harvesting and also make sure they have to wear a mask, but the best thing to do is to stay indoor. In the meantime, Tongan officials are working 24-7 to monitor further volcanic activity, which they say could last anywhere from weeks to months.